Welcome back, one and all, to Darksiders 3. I am the Dark Seraph, and last time we had been double crossed by our own Watcher. Well, actually, she wasn't even a Watcher. Truth of the matter is, she was the deadly sin of envy. And the envy we killed at the beginning of the game? My guess is it was probably just some Nephilim. But it doesn't matter. Why did they help me? That's, uh, kind of what humans do. And the fact that you send more than a few survivors our way didn't hurt. All for naught. We didn't pull you from the rubble to quit now. Envy holds the power of the Seven. Your betrayal can be seen on your face. Left for dead like some useless discarded thing. But it is not over. A reflecting pool? Aye, with a few adjustments. But it's only meant for you. It will only take you to your heart's desire. I desire only to finish what the Council began. Find your resolve, Horseman. It's all you have now. And it is what you need if you're to stop envy and unseat your former masters. Well, let's step inside. The portal. and judging that you've forgotten how to fight! You dare attack this holy phantom! I do! I dare! Because no one else ever has! And that makes this easy. Sweet! Death, strike, or catch it. You haughty sons of whores have had this coming for eons, and you have no one wars, but yourself one war sword, to thank. Sight. Your lust for power will be your undoing, Envy. Well, isn't that the pot calling a kettle black? When I'm done here and you're nothing left but pebbles, I will simply wait out the apocalypse and destroy whatever weakened generals remain. The Earth will be mine! It's over, Envy! You have failed! Kill her, horseman! Command. Oh, shut up! You command nothing but my scorn, and you will know my fury soon enough. That's for me, Trim. Yield or die, Envy. <laughs> Seriously? No, but it was worth a shot. I have no Nephilim's respite. I don't like that. I'm not going to 
Yeah, it's probably better I died in the first one because. Oh, I get my Nephilim for spite. What would back. you ask of this? Humble... Hold on. How many Lurcher clusters do I have? A lot. And then before I use those massages. As you wish. Yes. Okay, now. As you wish. Take your time. Okay. Let's do this.
have finally accomplished your task, Fury. Perhaps you should be rewarded. But perhaps not. Envy may have caught us unawares, but we have more than enough power to deal with an insect like you. You have overstepped your bounds, horseman. You shall be punished along with your brothers like the impudent child you are! No! I will not die like this! I will not allow your corruption! What did she just do? Honestly, I don't know. Protector of humanity. <laughs> Unity is key! If we're to move forward from here, we must move as one! Uh, you won't make it! The Council! Enraged. No doubt fueling the attack on Haven in secret. If you have a plan, for them... The time is now. Heaven! Hell! The Chard Council! They wish to see them annihilated. You know this, but... Perhaps you don't know the reason. Even before the Apocalypse. Why were your lives so hard? Because you were created for a great purpose and left unprotected. So those who fear you have set out to destroy you with false promises and wars and sin that they blame on you. They all fear you. That fear can be used against them. Humanity can win this war. Look around you. This is what's left of humanity, and we are in no shape to fight a war on the scale you suggest. No. You must hide. From the eyes of heaven and hell! The Council? That's exactly what must be done. But what humanity needs more than a good hidey-hole is a protector. A protector? I vow 
vowed to use all of the powers in my possession to protect humanity. And one day, we will set things right. Together. Uthain, my brother, War, is an innocent in this drama. If you ever find an opportunity to assist him in any way, I would ask you to do so. I will. Thank you, Maker. May our future be one of justice. Aye. Safe travels, Horseman. I'm guessing Darksiders 4 I'm gonna play a strife, and you know what, I'd be down for that. And that was Darksiders 3. I gotta say, that final boss! Kind of underwhelming. I expected something a bit more grand. I don't know. A bit more grandiose, I suppose. And Strife was Jones the whole time. Uh, hmm. Okay, I can work with that. That's interesting. Disguise himself. That's that's a fine thing you can do. I that's I actually that's I'm not being sarcastic. I kind of believe that he'd be able to do that. Strife and the Makers are going to do everything they can to hold off Hell's Hordes. <laughs> um, so yeah, that was... It's not a perfect game. Lack of a map, for one thing. Oh, give me a map, a map, a map. Give me a fucking map in these kind of games. Gun, gunfire games, if you are for some reason watching this, give me a fucking map. I don't, I don't know how else I can explain that. You, 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 this game needed a map. Some of the puzzles, like that tornado, I, I honestly don't even know what I was supposed to, what you expected me to do there. That, what would make, you cannot blow up a tornado is what I'm trying to say. You, there is no reason anyone would think to do that. That oil slowed you down. You'd think that's an obstacle you have to get over so you can get through the gate. I'll look to see if there's any DLC I can cover for this, but as far as I'm aware, there isn't, and this is going to be the official finale. So, I enjoyed the game, shortcomings and all, map, uh, the platforming was a little clumsy, um, a slight delay being able to dodge after a combo. It's manageable to play, but out of all reality, one thing I want to know, why is this game rated in the M for Mature? I don't understand why this game is rated M. There's no nudity, there's no intense violence, it's pretty tame. Yeah, there's blood and there's some not much gore. There's some blood, some gore, and it's violent. I don't see why this couldn't be a rated T game. It's not like there's any obscene language or dark themes. I mean, let's take a look at Uncharted here. T for teen for blood, 
language, use of alcohol, use of tobacco, and violence. I would say this game is more tame than Uncharted 4. And let me be clear, I like Uncharted 4. But, but the point, I don't understand why this game is rated to in for mature. It doesn't, it doesn't make any sense to me. It's a good game. Not perfect, mind you, but I did enjoy it for what it was. Um, some of the character designs were a little over-designed, particularly the Makers. I don't know, I just, I didn't care for the design of the Makers. I liked the design of the Horsemen. Some of the Sins designs I thought were pretty cool. I didn't, that twist coming at the end, I didn't see whatsoever. I expected Pride to be the final boss. No, it's Envy, I didn't expect that. That's, that's a good twist. I was under the impression that Envy was dead the whole time and in the talisman, but now that I think about it, there were some subtle cues to the Watcher because she cared an awful lot about that talisman. And her tone of voice sounded a bit jealous every time she mentioned the talisman. And yeah, I kind of predicted the whole spiel about... Cry about the dead fury overcoming the deadly sins is overcoming her own in quality of uh, insecure um, shortcomings I suppose her own flaws because she was jealous she was angry she was proud she was lazy the only thing sin that didn't really seem to fit her was gluttony she didn't care for anything she didn't desire any material good I guess avarice though you can make the argument she was jealous of her brothers but yeah that's that's about all I've got to say on this I mean I, I liked the game it's got problems lack of a map uh, the combat's a little clumsy but the game's a little clumsy but overall it's decent I don't think it's worth sixty dollars so buy it on the cheap <sighs> Oh. So the young one plays nursemaid to mankind. It is of no concern. Abaddon rules over the earth. Heaven and hell scramble to take their place at the table. And the council? <laughs> the council works against the very balance they profess to uphold. Soon, corruption will overtake them all. And only I shall remain. You <laughs> may go. Okay. Who was that? That unnamed demon that gave Fury her power? Or Luster power, excuse me? So, yeah, that was Darksiders 3. Thank you all for watching. I'm the Dark Seraph, signing off.